because I was not here last week, so I prepared this presentation related to psychology and food. Here is content. I talk about food addiction and compared with psychological hunger and physical hunger. And self-test about food addiction and treatment for food addiction. First, what is food addiction? Briefly, people who did a diet of hunger, it means not eating for food, or not eating food for losing weight. Mm. Uh, their pleasure uh, that people at uh, their pleasure center mm -hmm. is called Kerak Junchu they are more develop developing than or than ordinary people because they don't eat what they want to eat so their pleasure center about food is developing and if their pleasure center is more strong they feel more pleasure than ordinary people when eating same food. Finally, although they don't hunger, they intake food to keep this pleasure. All this situation is called food addiction. Here is two exper experiments about fat addiction. First, eating water and fresh, fresh cream. When eating fresh cream, some reactions are found in brain, this spot. And these, um, these reactions are in pleasure center. However, when eating water, any reactions are found in brain. Second one is mouse experiments. They eat high fat and high calorie diets, maybe they are in fat addiction. Although they are given pain, they choose a high-fat food. It means pain can't stop a pleasure from eating fat. These behavior and patterns are also found in drug addiction. From this experiment, I think many people are easily calling food addiction. And actually many people are in car carbohydrate addiction today. It's another part about food addiction related to psychology. People who are in food addiction can't distinguish psychology hunger and physical hunger. Psychological hunger is not real hunger. It's a self-test about physical and psychological hunger. Um, psychological hunger has these three characteristics. Hunger comes suddenly and strongly wants a specific food and can't bear a hunger. However, physical hunger comes slowly and wants various food and can bear a hunger. These are self-tests about food addiction. As I know, there are not official tests about food addiction, but many tests have similar list after this time mm -hmm. to this test. Um, as I talked before, food addiction is related in psychological manner. So to overcome a food addiction, First, distinguish between psychological hunger and physical hunger and relieving obsession for losing weight and eliminating overeating habit in special condition. And last, changing habits that releasing stress by food. Mm -hmm.